Olympia, Washington has long been a haven for artists, for musicians, for actors, creative people from all over the country travel to the beauty and the splendor of the state capital of Washington State, Olympia, Washington. Also the seat of county government. There's always been wonderful things, a great place to raise a family, and now, this. And this. And that. <laughs> Olympia has always had, just like every city, it struggles with opioid addicts and things, but it's always been kind of hidden and under the, under, swept under the rug. And nowadays in Olympia, in 2017, you have to be careful where you walk. Remember Where's Waldo? Well, we're going to play Where's Paraphernalia? And uh, see how much paraphernalia, syringes, baggies, rig caps, whatever we can find in downtown Olympia in one afternoon. Let's go for a walk. It's not even just in the alleyways, it's in just in parking lots. There's paraphernalia. Lose your pants in these alleys. Okay, now this isn't even in an alley, this is just right in the street. What the fuck? <laughs> for the city of Olympia. We were just playing this game, where's uh, paraphernalia? I'm guessing you might find paraphernalia occasionally? Correct. Um, how many syringes do you think you might find on a daily basis? It's Roughly. probably more like a weekly basis. Okay, a weekly uh, basis. What I'd do you say think? about a uh, half dozen. Half a dozen? So I just started walking around in the alleys and parking lots down here. Matter of fact, there was a clump of them down here against this wall. And I have found five in less than an hour. Some, I mean, <laughs> wow, the opioid thing is out of control. Um, I hope you're taking precautions. I see you've got some good gloves on, so you're not going to get stuck with anything. I guess that's your little picker-upper. Nice. Well, thank you very much for your service for the city. We appreciate it greatly. And be safe. Okay, and can you just say, where's paraphernalia? Yes, where's paraphernalia? Wow. I've seen more than that guy sees in a week in like an hour. Oh! Uh, and this little hiding spot. Hidden little corner. And we continue. Paraphernalia! 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 Pretty sure. God, and it smells like. Distinct aroma of urine, very strong urine odor here. I'm probably standing in a puddle of it. And uh, makes me think that maybe this little stairwell nook. Now, I might not be a detective, but today you can call me Sherlock motherfucking Holmes. 
So I'm guessing this is a, a drug spot right here where people get high. I don't know what would lead me to think that. <laughs> uh. I don't know, Watson, but where there's smoke, there's usually fire. Yeah, Sherlock. Hmm, looks like you found another drug den in Olympia. This looks like party fucking central. Oh wow. We've got rig caps. We have cleaner solvents and we actually have a rig. Um yeah, it looks like a little party zone here. How many does that make? I've been wandering around for maybe an hour and a half. <laughs> sure that baggie is not being used or it wasn't being used for dietary supplements well unless you're talking about crystal meth as a dietary supplement I mean what's better than a drug that completely eliminates your need for food or you, you tricks your body into thinking you don't need food so maybe it was a dietary supplement of sorts but yeah add that to the list with a rig cap and then right across the way I noticed yeah, they call these uh, bindles with the drugs are sold in. Wow, okay. Uh, I think you get the idea. I sure as hell got the idea. I actually had to come down here and see for myself. You saw what happened. I mean, I was walking around for less than two hours and we found baggies or bindles. We found rig caps. And we actually found Syringes, hypodermic needles, dirty things get you, uh, you know, diseases, HIV, um, all of the hepatitis things. I wouldn't come down here with a baby or with a pet that likes to sniff around in the corner because it's dangerous downtown Olympia. Opioid crisis has reached epidemic levels. It's been another great Zart production.